Hey guys, welcome to today's video. We're going to be bringing down the latest news around the NFL. Before we get started, though, please drop a quick like and a sub on today's video. That would really help my channel grow. I'd really appreciate that. With that said, let's dive right into the video, and I hope you enjoy. <laughs> So the Dolphins continue to make moves here. They're going to go out and uh, claim Freddie Swain off waivers from uh, Denver. Kind of funny, actually, given that I'm pretty sure Freddie Swain was on the Dolphins last year and then got claimed on by like from off the practice squad by the Broncos. Um, so went from so he 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 was he, he was in Seattle uh, from 2020 to 2021 and then was on Miami for like a week. I think he played in one game for the Dolphins um, and then you know got claimed by Denver off the practice squad. So then he was in Denver last year. And in Denver, you know, had had a 74 receiving yards, four catches, didn't do too much. But, you know, when he was on the field in Seattle, and this was a couple of years ago at this point, um, but he was he was pretty productive, you know, as a as a third, fourth, as a third option at the time uh, behind Tyler Lockett um, and DK Metcalf uh, in, 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 in that rotation. Uh, 25 catches, 343 yards and four touchdowns in 2021. Um, he will just be part of the receiving core with the Dolphins. Obviously, he's not going to be a starter, right? Tyree Kill, Jalen Waddle, um, are 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 the guys, um, you know, for for this Dolphins offense. Um, and they're gonna they're gonna be the guys for the rest of the year. But a guy like a guy like Freddie Swain adds a lot of um, you know, veteran receiver uh, help. Um, you can never have enough solid receivers who have played in the league before. Um, and, and that's exactly what Swain is going to bring. He's also been part of the Dolphins before, as I said, uh, was part of them early in the year last year. Um, and yeah, I mean, he'll, he'll be behind Trent Sherfield and behind Cedric Wilson, probably in the depth chart. Um, but nonetheless, a fifth wide receiver, um, for the Dolphins, uh, as they try and retool, uh, this offense around to a tongue by low. And with that said, that's pretty much going to end the video for today. Did you agree with my analysis? Why or why not? Leave your comments and thoughts in the comment section down below. I'd love to hear what you guys have to say. Also, if you're new around here, please drop a like and a sub on today's video. I'd really appreciate that. With that said, I hope you enjoyed the video. And until next time, see ya.